Hey guys, welcome back to some more Tennis World Tour and part 49 of our Let's Play. In today's episode, we are taking on Alexander Zverev in the quarterfinals of the French Open. The winner of this match will play Dominic Team or Stan Vavrinka, both very good players. Federer uh, is playing Monfils and Dimitrov playing Goffin, so four fantastic matches. Hopefully we're going to be the ones to win this one. Thank you for all the support on the series so far. Another reminder about Captain Goodspeed Retro. Um, if you guys want to see uh, more Top Spin 4 and uh, retro games and stuff, then go over and subscribe to that channel uh, and and check it out. But for today... For today, we're playing Alexander Zverev, who is meant to be the second best player on this game, according to many things I've heard. So, it's going to be tough. But, you know, we've played very, very well so far, particularly uh, in the last match, I think, uh, against Lucas Puyol. A little bit of lag early on in this match and something I have been noticing a, a lot more recently. Don't really know why it's the case, but... That was close. But hopefully you guys are good and still enjoying the series. Obviously the US Open starts in a couple of weeks. Who do you think is going to win that? Is it going to be uh, Rafa? Is it going to be Novak? Or is it going to be Roger Federer winning a sixth title there? Juan Martin Del Potro. Murray's back as well. So lots of things to look forward to uh, in the next few weeks um, while that's on. But two break points for, for Zverev in this first game. Very much need to get on top of that right now. Good shot. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. Now Zverev is another player that I haven't watched a lot of and uh, obviously he's, he's one of the, the best young prospects in the game. Um, at the moment and you know, top four in the world and winning titles winning master series you know he beat Rafa Nadal on clay um, but uh, it'll be interesting to see how his career develops that's wide now would be a great time to pull out an edge but again uh, you know, I wouldn't know what his strengths and weaknesses are particularly. So we're going in clean and, well, a good hold of serve early on in this match. For us right there. The forehand goes wide. That's close. Shot. That's a great shot from us there. <coughs> Chance here. And we put him away. 15 30. This is a great start for us. Yeah, two break points. Obviously, Zverev had two break points in the last game. I think he had three in the end, but didn't take any. He has to be oh, that was close. That was very close. Still haven't tried Fortnite all those weeks ago that I downloaded that. Still haven't 
done anything about it. Come on. Yes, what a shot. We've got the break early on in this match. Come on, Joe. That second serve is kind of strong. That's the thing that's been letting us down the most this tournament is our serve, and I'm at a loss to think why that would be the case, but gotta be careful here. I love 30. Oh, has Verev turned on the style now? He'll lose his chance at a break. This yeah, is that's a good serve. 15, Need a couple more of them. This yep. Point is critical. 30, Two more break points fended off. Make that three. If we could keep to that serving all the time, we'd probably be unstoppable. Oh, nice passing shot. We need a big serve again to drag us out of trouble. And there it is. Tie in the air, and that's going to be well out. Now can we find another race on this side? Well, we can't this time. It's funny, isn't it? When you need to save yourself, you can find them all the time. When you need to win, it becomes a little bit more difficult. That's a good shot, though. We consolidate the break, and within a blink of an eye, really, three love. Oh, shot. Few unforced errors from Zverev so far. That hits the net. I mean, we had the point anyway, but unforced error once again. Uh, starting to look a little bit easy for us. Uh, uh, yep, yeah. there you go. That break was important. Fall off within eight minutes. But we know from past experience that these moments of dominance don't last forever. Just gotta keep pushing on and take advantage of this time. A real where we're lesson in how to serve. Completely on top of, of the match and hopefully we can have a bit of a more comfortable service game this time. He's already had about seven break points on our serve, but took any of them as yet, but that's not a reason to give him any more chances. You would think a player of Zverev's quality would uh, eventually take one. He's got another opportunity here. 
Forehand a little bit suspect when we're on the run. But again, we pull out a big serve when we need it. We need to stop giving ourselves a, a reason to pull out the big guns. He should mix his serve up again. Little drop shot. He comes forward. He does get there. Oh, what a volley. He read it perfectly. We hammered that forehand. Look at this. But he read it. And he hit a good winner. It's hit oh. Today. What a serve. Not often we get an ace that side. And we do again on this side. Five love. Zverev, surprisingly, after 10 minutes, serving to stay in this first set. Yeah, nice one. Brilliant. That shot there was fantastic, and look how far out court he was. He still, you know, made it fairly close to getting back, but we're two points away from this first set now. Oh, how close was that? Not um, three set points. That's wide. Really good rally. But we've set up two set points now. 15, 40. Uh, ah, why didn't he hit it? annoying. We played such a casual drop shot there and, and you know we were there we were ready to hit it down the line and just decide not to hit it. <laughs> oh and now it was very good serve and we well, saved two set points here. Well I mean, you know, if ever we were in a bit of trouble, it could be now. Well, there you go. 5 1. Now, hopefully, we can serve it out, but he's asked a question. That's what's called tennis perfection. We haven't had a comfortable service game yet. Can this be the one? That's out. Yeah, good serve.
Oh, what a shot. Two set points. Mm. Double fault. Fourth set point. Yes, we've done it this time. Big serve down the tee. And hands up if you expected us to beat Zverev 6-1 in the first set. Put your hand back down because you're lying. Nobody expected that. But we've absolutely dominated. And uh, we'll have a look at those stats there. He had eight break points, didn't take any of them. That's what's done it. You know, we were managing to dig ourselves out of um, service games. And he wasn't apart from that last one. Close. Well, I'm expecting a, a, a bit of a closer set this time. I'm expecting them to be on the comeback trail. A backhand that goes way wide. Goes down the line. That is brilliant. What a rally that was. 15. Oh, no. Yes, break point. I can't believe this. I've got a break point. I'm 30 love down to get a break point is crucial. And there you go, we take it. You know, we're, we're looking good out there. He isn't stepping into his forehead. Little drop shot brings him forward, opens up the court for us, and we take it. It's on the line. Racing towards the first Grand Slam semi final here. I know we're only a set and a break up, but we're just playing with such freedom out there. The forehand goes long. I had a feeling that that was going to go long, that's why I went back. Hopefully that would have been safer, but well, it doesn't matter anyway. Com most comfortable serve of the match, or service game. Too low. The forehand goes long. Not enough control in the shot. Oh, what a show. Again. We're just dominating at the moment. We've, we've got our eye in and we've 
got Zverev exactly where we want him. Yeah. Two break points. He's got to keep the pressure on the return. 15 40. Two break points here. Virtual set points. Look at that. We ran round our backhand and he hits the unforced error. Incredible. Mm. Well. Things are starting to get really exciting here. We're playing really well and throughout the whole tournament really we've been on top form and you know we were saying if we can take this form into the quarters, semis, finals, we could be in for winning this event and that would be absolutely crazy. A real lesson in how to serve. Betty Love. You know you're playing well when the ones that shouldn't go in are going in. And then as soon as it's short, we're taking our chances. This is absolutely brilliant. 6-1 for love. Brilliant. I, I'm just blown away by how well we're playing here. Starting to go for it a little bit too much, and it's just playing into our hands, really. And that gives three break points. Things are looking good. He's, he's barely winning any points at the moment. I tried the servant volley, didn't really work. Three break points. Finally, miss. <laughs> well, we've done it. That was the break point. We slapped the forehand back at the baseline, and now, after only 21 minutes, we're serving for a place. Oh, sorry, serving for a two set of love lead. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves. Mm. Well, I'm impressed. Well, a couple of loose shots in this uh, game so far from us. Great, sir. We're making up for it with some brilliant serving. Oh. Little drop shot. He does come forward and collects it. Oh, but we hit a beautiful passing shot, and he can't believe how many lines we're hitting here. I mean, he's got every right to think, right, I'm in the point. Bang. You can see how much that clipped the line by. Set point. And we've done it. Another fabulous serve to end the second set. 6-1, six, 6 love. What a fantastic set of tennis that was for us. And this was defined as the the best rally so far. Or at least in that set. And if you look at that first serve percentage, 86 five aces in that set. It felt like more. Only seven unforced errors. Only 14 winners. 
I mean, that's pretty crazy in itself. Five unforced errors for Zverev and uh, only seven points in the whole set. That is where we're going to leave it for this episode. If you have enjoyed that, make sure you do leave a like down below. Uh, it really does mean a lot for me. It really does help out the channel as well. Subscribe if you'd like to see more. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching and goodbye.